two, three, two, one. Low traffic, pretty quiet. Won't hear any major highways. The road's a little bit rough, but it's not not the worst road. Just like neighborhood feel wise, it's a little rough. Front of the house, it's flat roof, so you can't see it, but it's damaged on the inside. Front of the house needs a little bit of cleanup. It's all brick, but it looks a little beat up. Porch, there's some damage there and there. Otherwise, it's concrete, pretty sturdy. Don't see any board ups really. Neighbors are pretty well kept. Walking. The living area opens to the dining. Some plumbing leaks at some point, maybe. I don't think that's all the way from the roof. Tubs right there. Walls and floors are pretty beat up. This wood doesn't match this wood. And a kitchen back here. Needs a fully gut it looks like. It's pretty nasty. Ceilings peeling. Mold. Lots of trim damage, as well as the walls, all the way down there. Backyard, pretty small. The porch just needs a clean up, it's sturdy, it looks like. House on the left, there. Notice some weird spacing in the bricks up there. Fill that in for some repairs. Basement exit. Uh, foundation looks pretty good. Don't see any major cracks. Upstairs. One of three bedrooms. Lots of trim issues, it looks like. Windows are old, old wooden. Walls are pretty damaged. And there's bad ceiling leak 
damage. Looks like there's a bucket here catching water. And this is pretty damaged underneath of the black stuff. A small closet in here. Second bedroom. Medium size, no ceiling damage in here really. And a small closet above the stairs. Thanks buddy, that's the last time I'll be in here. More damage in here on the ceiling. Needs a full gut. And that's the shared bathroom. And this is the last bedroom. Small closet in here as well. Basement now. Just, stairs are a little messed up. One of them's broken. It's all paneling down here, and it's pretty short. Right here, this goes under the porch, so it actually is shorter for like seven feet. I think it's like 6'6 six, six for the rest of the way. And in the back it goes to 6'7 or something. Looks like it's been flooded down here before. There's mold along the bottom of the paneling. And a bunch of stuff's wet. It's a half bathroom. The joists look alright for the most part. Some mold from the moisture. But I don't see any termites. Here, the utility room. So used to be a boiler here, which is missing. And hot water heater. It looks like copper plumbing that changes over to, or no, it looks like all copper, but it looks old. Lots of green stuff on it. And this is the last room back here. Which is very unlevel down here in this room. The rest of it's pretty level. An exit, basement exit, and uh, the uh, panel. Which it looks like they got like a trash bag over that was stopping a leak from upstairs. Because this is the only part where the joists and the floor. Looks like it's rotting through a little bit. Yeah, it looks like rotting damage from moisture. The rest of it looks pretty good though.